Hello Taurus, thank you for tuning into your general read. For the main read, I'm using the Morgan Greer Tarot by Paul Foster Case and Arthur Edward Waite. For the support of Oracle Cards, the Angel Answers Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue and Radley Valentine. Okay, already shuffled. Only one? All right, well, let's see. Maybe more will come out later. All right, so what are we doing, Taurus? What are we doing? Your overall energy seems to be the Queen of Cups. As I always say, don't get caught up in the gender, but to me, it's a very loving outlook. A very looking out for other people, very much... Um, Know, caring, very caring. Very, the Queen of Cups is a very motherly card, kind of like the Empress card, but this is someone who shows their emotion, gives love, um, is very huggy, usually, in my opinion, not afraid to show how they feel, that type of person. That being said, as we go into this time frame, we've got the Star card, the King of Rods, and the Emperor. Now, I feel like there, you have a lot of hope for this situation. You're continuing on as normal. Things might seem like they're solid. Because of that, because of the stability of the situation, you're holding off on a change you want to make. Now, that being said, the reason I'm, one of the reasons I'm saying that is you have weight above those three cards. Those three cards are the action line. And so you're waiting on making some change because you're feeling like things are going, things have a good rate, they're, they're going at a good speed. You're feeling very good about them and it seems like a very st stable situation. I'm not seeing anything in the environment. This being said, you, you definitely do want to make a change. The question is, why do you want to make the change? Because there's something you want to change. I feel like um, discontent with something. So the situation itself is very active and stable. But you're just, there's something about it that you're not, you're not loving it. You like that it's continuous. You like that it's stable, and you get the you got the star card. So you're hopeful that it's going to continue at a good rate. But something about it, you just want to move on. You do want to move on. You're having these thoughts. The thing is, even though you're having those thoughts, you I feel like you're putting out feelers. For some of you, it's a job thing. Whatever the situation is, you you want things to change. And you're putting out feelers in some sense. Either you're looking up information to get you closer to what you want, you're talking with people to see what's available out there. If it's a job, you're searching on sites, you're searching through the internet. Whatever you've got to do, you're putting out feelers. I feel like what the big issue here is, when you do this, because you've got the magician here, the next part of your line, you put out those feelers and they find you something. Like The environment is very conducive and very appreciative of you. You got the Nine of Pentacles, which means things are going to your favor. You're starting this as you put out the feelers. This is you putting out those feelers. It's a very receptive environment. So these feelers go out and you're looked on positively. I feel like even like you, some of you might even apply for a job just to see where you stand, just to go through the process. Because you're just kind of like, well, I like the thought that I could get this job, but maybe I really couldn't. Maybe I'll just apply and go through the process just to see where it lands. Some of you, at least one of you out there, I feel like, well, more than one. There's a few of you out there are going to do that. 
because you're just like, well, you know, it's a, it's a far shot, but you don't know if you don't try. So might as well see. Maybe I can get some information, see where I stand, or if there's something I'm lacking, I know what I need to do to actually keep going, you know, to maybe get this in the future. Okay. So this is where this starts. Environment, judgment in your favor. I feel like you put out your feelers and something comes back to you that you can have somebody's like offers you something so if you went for this job you thought was out of your reach but you're like you know what? I'll try and see what they say just so I can find out what exactly am I lacking or what else do I need to do so I can get this job at a later time and it turns out they're like oh no you can do this and we can you know they're they're like yeah you can have this job and they offer it to you this is where <laughs> this is where it becomes like a little thing because you're just like oh queen of rods on your side what are you going to do because it's open this is in your thoughts like are you going to settle for what you have where you're not happy even though you feel like the situation is very active and stable are you going to stay there or are you going to move in this better direction i do feel like you're going to go in this better direction for most of you the thing is i don't think you really thought you were going to get it but the situation goes to your favor. I don't think you thought you were going to get it. You tried for it, and you're like, it's possible. You have the idea of possibility, but you're like, well, I'm one of many, or you're just kind of like, yeah, I'll try for it, but, you know, who knows? Who knows? Like, why not? Like, you're not worried about it. Like, it's going to, you're not, like, over-centering on it. Like, oh, do I want to leave my job? Do I not want to leave my job? You're just kind of going about it like, you know what? It's kind of a far shot, but I'll give it a shot. You never know. Maybe I'll get it, and then you get it. Then you get it, and you're just like, so do I want to take this because it's it is what I want, or do I want to stay in the stable, active situation that I really don't like? And I feel like you go forward with it. I really do. For the most of you, I think you're gonna go forward with it. It's just you give it a shot, you try, and you're like, well, I might be lacking some things, but you know, at least I'll learn what those things are. I don't. F I feel like when you put it put this out and you try to make something happen, I just don't feel like you realize how conducive the situation is to you. And it goes to your favor, and you're just like, wow. And then you go forward with it. I feel like there's not a lot of stress here because of that. And when I'm seeing the Queen of Cups again, like there's situation, there's things, there's ties with this situation. But I feel like the situation itself you don't care for. But as you go forward, um, you can't stay with that situation, even though there's... There's connections that you do love, people. I feel like it's more people, really, honestly. Some of you, it's the job. For example, like if you work somewhere where you work with animals, like you love the animals or something like that. Um, so you very much, there's, there's a piece, there's an element here that you very much do love, but you're discontent with it. You're just ready to move on for the most part, the overall. And you just put out this feeler like, you know what, just to see. Because you want to be happier. It's the discontent that's really motivating you. And that's where the Queen of Cups comes in. Like, you want to be happier. I feel like that's better a place to say. Because it's right above the Magician. You're just making this... You're giving this a shot. You're doing what you need to do to try to make it better. Because you're like, I don't really like it. But you know what? Since I don't like it, why don't I just give it a shot? Just to see what possibilities are out there. And it goes your way. I just feel like it's a shock. Well, not like a zap shock. But just like... You're like, wow, I didn't really think I'd get that. But now that I have, I'm going to take it. And I feel like the majority of you do. Okay. Anything else? It's a nice, it seems like a short, simple read, but it's a nice one. So I, no complaints from me, that's for sure. I wouldn't be complaining. <laughs> like, it seems like it's all going your way. I think the big thing is if this hits you at the right time, is like, really, put your best foot out there. Give it a shot. What do you have to lose? Because you might just end up getting what you want majority of you I think are so go for it I would say all right well thank you very much for watching if you'd like a uh, paid read from me go ahead and shoot me an email james for at gmail.com james the number four astral at gmail.com thank you